Hey there, I'm going to show you how to make custom profiles for the Universal x86 tuning utility, formerly known as the AMD APU tuning utility, though as you can see, they still use that name on the interface itself. Now to make custom profiles, you just have to go to the custom profiles page here. Now what you see on the screen right here is what I put in to make my custom profile for 30 watts on the Ryzen 5 5500U. These are pretty much the only things you need to modify if you're trying to make your own custom profiles everything else you can leave alone just make sure that these specific ones that are checkmarked you have set one thing to note is that the only things you ever really need to change when making a new profile is to pretty much adjust anything that says TDP so that would be the PPL0 PL1 and PL2 TDP configuration so for 30 watts they're all set to 30 but if I'm trying to make a profile to go down to 15 watts then I I would just set all of these to 15 instead and all you really have to do after that is set the preset name and then just save the preset and you're good to go it's just that simple i still like to just use the pre-made presets but if i ever want to go back to the stock 15 watt tdp it's nice to just have a preset i can go to and i do also like having the full 30 watt one as well but you can pretty much customize this to whatever tdp you want you can get as specific as you want and an easy way to verify that your TDP is actually working the way you configured it is to just use something like Hardware Info 64 while you launch something like Cinebench R23. If you look at the CPU package power, that should tell you what the TDP it's actually configured at. So as you can see right here, since I have it configured at 15 watts, we are pretty much using 15 watts. If we switch over to the 30 watt TDP, you'll see that the package power is going to go up to pretty much 30. It's just that simple to set up. But anyways, I hope you found this to be useful. If you did, be sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.